Hi everyone, welcome to Naresh Technologies. This is Srinivas. In this session, we are going to discuss about uh, graphics, graphics in C language, graphics in C language. So, first of all, so what is a graphics and where we are using a graphics? What are the advantages of graphics? The first one simple, what is graphics? what is graphics means generally c applications c applications runs in a console window in a console window only that is what we called a black screen black screen we can also call it as a character user interface or command user interface on the black screen only we have to run C applications right and here it is using graphics using graphics we can develop GUI graphical user interface in the library in the C library C library is having a header file that is graphics dot h header file graphics dot h it contains contains n number of predefined functions n number of predefined functions to implement to implement GUI is nothing but graphical user interface graphical user interface in C applications in C applications if you want to implement GUI programming graphical user interface programming we use graphics dot h header file sir how can I open that graphics.h header file? So, before going to work with the graphics.h functions, first I have to study because n number of functions means uh, hundreds of hundreds of functions are available. As a programmer, we cannot remember those many functions. So, that is why first we should understand how to open how to open write that library and how to study about functions which are available in a graphics dot h generally we use the editor to develop applications is a blue screen on the blue screen if you want to open library library you have to type control f1 this is actually help window control f1 is a help window it, it will show keywords what all the keywords available available and second one header files header files how to open means for example here i am opening blue screen and here it is so now i am typing here i mean i am pressing control f1 control f1 i am pressing now it opens that help window help window it will open and here it is showing keywords and header files right here it is here it is header files i am opening here we are using arrow keys to move up and down here it is in a turbo c in some of the blue screens some of the editors cursors will not work very very important so here it is now select using arrow keys select one option and here it is press enter it will show all the header files available if you want to see more header files so what is the key you have to press what is the key here they have given clearly page down is the key page down right whenever you page down so then these are and if you want to move up here it is page up is there page up and page down we have to use the keys page up and page down keys are available on your keyboard and next here it is we are using we need to select that graphics dot h header file this is the header file we need to open to see what all the functions available in a graphics dot h here now here it is 
I am opening graphics.h and see these are the these are some of the methods available in a graphics.h and if you want to see more functions here it will not show the complete information of functions it will show only identity name of the functions it will show so what is the input it is taking and what is the output it is giving if you want to see such type of informations we should open right if you click on the identity then it will provide the complete information like input output type input type and description what it will do what task it will perform right the complete information it will provide if you want to see more methods same story here it is a page down and page up buttons we are using this is simply how to open header files in a c library and now here one important discussion generally generally here to develop or to implement gui programming gui programming we need to convert generally c applications c applications uses console that is character user interface or command user interface that we need to convert cui we should convert into gui mode we should convert into gui mode actually cui means what we can print the information in form of characters this is character data and gui graphical user interface and here it is whatever the information we are printing that prints in a pixels format pixels so we should convert cui mode to gui mode to implement that graphical user interface that output screen we should convert from cui mode to gui mode into pixels format sir who will convert and what is the method we are using for this conversion what is the method right one method is available one method is available so look at that look at that method here it is here it is this is the method init graph init graph is a method is used to convert cui mode into gui mode init graph method initialization of graphics mode in it means what initialization when you click on enter now it will provide the complete information of that init graph see initializes the graphics system okay forget about a far it's a pointer type we'll see later now init graph method is not returning anything to anyone so what is the return type it's a void type void means what it's returning nothing and next here it is taking three input arguments one is a graphics driver second one is a graphics mode and third one is a path to driver graphics driver graphics mode and third one is a path to driver right here also for pointers no need to check sir what is the graph driver what is the graph mode and what is the path to driver that i'll explain here init graph method is taking integer pointer type is a driver type integer pointer it's a mode type next one character pointer path to the driver generally this path to the driver is the last one is just like a path to graphics.h path to graphics.h about this we'll discuss later generally whenever we install any editor like a c software c editor when you install some of the sample programs available sample programs in the sample programs graphics related programs also available if you follow such type of programs then you will understand the path clearly that i'll show you some of the files i'll open then you can understand 
Next, what is the mode? Simply, mode we can call it as a screen resolution. Screen resolution. But how to set the resolution means uh, no need to set the resolution. Depends on the driver. Automatically, a default mode will be activated to implement that GUI graphical user interface programming. Next, sir, then how to set the driver, sir? Driver actually, whenever we install a C software, C editor, or any C, C software along with a C compiler, C compiler in the library, so many predefined driver programs available n number of drivers are available n drivers available drivers means what is just converters which is suitable for our computer suppose if you don't know they have given one macro what is that macro macro name is a detect macro this is for auto detection of driver auto detection of suitable driver it will detect automatically it will detect automatically so whatever the driver which is suitable for your hardware devices and for your computer so that will be detected automatically by this macro i'll show you this here here graph driver whenever you click on this see how many drivers are available Actually, all these drivers are enumeration type. Enumeration type. Enumeration is nothing but set of elements, right? So, means what each element will follow one task, means what can perform one task simply. And here it is so many drivers are available. But if you are unable to recognize as a basic programmer, you are just learner. If you are unable to recognize a driver which is suitable for your hardware, then simply we should request for auto detection for auto detection they have given this macro very clearly detect is a macro ok so this is and using this init graph only we can convert cui mode into gui mode and one more important one is a close graph method close graph along with the initialize we should use a close graph method also what close graph method will do init method is initializes close graph method will close once your program execution has been completed if you want to come out of the graphics mode we have to go for this close graph if you click on this simply here it is showing that message it shut down the graphics system one is initializes and one is a shutdown it is not taking any input and it is not giving any output so both the input types and output types are void types ok so this is the basic introduction part of graphics in C language right how to write graphics programs right and how to develop a small uh, screen servers right in graphics we will see in a coming sessions thank you for watching for more videos please subscribe to naresh it channel thank you thank you all